Hi there, friends and friends, it's Oliver. And uh, today we will have a look at the main basic exercise we should do and do every training. Lesson one, exercise three, is the main basic exercise. And you should repeat it over and over and over again because it contains the main parries, circle parries, thrust center positions, and it starts with exercise two of the first lesson, this straight thrust in a position. Let's demonstrate it once. I know, I know, but it's not that difficult, trust me. Um, we'll have a closer look. But first, uh, let's have a look at the main parries and the thrust in opposition. On guard. So, we have the classical four parries for the high inside, parata di quarta, high outside, parata di terza, low inside line, parata di mezzo cerchio or, or di quinta, and in um, the Scalzi, you could also um, rotate the uh, a little bit more, but quarta in the low line is absolutely okay. And for the outside low line, the Parata uh, di Okay, thank you. Now to the uh, thrust in opposition. Um, but first, every time the master extends the arm, this is an attack. Normally, or rarely, I would lunge, but I'm the master, I skip the lunge. So, I extend, he parries, and from the parries, he does a thrust in a position, um, like so. So you see the difference, if he would do a botta dritte, he would extend the arm first, and then lunge. But for a thrust in opposition or in collaboration, um, he extends the arm and lunge at the same time to hold the bind. So we start with exercise two, but this time the master parries, disengage and to the inside, to the outside, low inside, low outside. Again, high inside, he stops in opposition. You see, every main parry is here in this sequence. Now I disengage and uh, student parries by circle parry. Then I do a double disengagement and he follows and parries in opposition. After that, he does a thrust in opposition and the master gets hit. When he's returned on guard, I disengage for the next opening and this game continues to all the four openings. So and once again from another perspective. So you practice precision over and over again, and that's the main point. Um, did you have such an exercise which you should do every training? Let me know in the comments and see you in the next video.